Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be the a big a swatch box here of the 20 plus 3 Beatles colors and top coats, base coat, all the fun stuff. I did the smaller um, collection that I ordered, which is these beautiful swatches right here. If you'd like to see how those go on and we cure them, that's what they look like. I'm getting ready to do this big 20 piece set. So, this set I put back in the way it's supposed to be. I'm actually going to set these swatches back here out of my way. This is how it comes shipped to you. There is three. Put you out of my out of my way. There's three styrofoam packages. They are all neatly and securely in there. I have taken some of these out and looked at them and played uh, with one of the colors. Um, but just I just used one and it was the glitter I have on this finger right here and it is spectacular um, and then here is the little directions this comes in all of the Beatles packaging but it is just a how to apply and use your gel polish so and I believe these Beatles you do have to do 60 seconds not 30 so that is a difference between um, the polishes I have been using you can do those for 30 seconds these you do have to do for 60 seconds so I'm just popping these out really quickly and then I will bring you guys back and we're going to do the swatches and this is going to be a little bit of a longer video there are 20 swatches to go through so grab you a drink grab you a snack hit subscribe enter my giveaway that I have going and do all those fun things and I will be right back okay guys welcome back I'm just moving a lot around because my main light that I use is out. Um, this is how they come packaged. If I can get you in, in there. And these are the, um, the foundation and the two top coats. You have a glossy and a matte. And here are the small bottles. So I'm going to pop these out. Sit the um, bottles back here. And we're going to finish taking these out of their styrofoam if I can get them out. Okay. So, uh, I know you guys can't see it, but here I have all 20 colors out of the packaging. And they are beautiful. This bundle is called, it did have a name and it was on the box, Fall Festival. So we are going to swatch all these. It is greens, oranges, yellows, a couple of blues. Um, I think a, a black glitter. I'm not sure that looks very like a black tone to me. I don't know, but we're going to swatch all of these on these little nail. Let me turn you this way a little bit, maybe. On these little nail wheels. So, I'm not going in any particular order. I just set them out. And, um, there we go. But this is the, the smaller bottles. These are a 5 mil where the other bottles I showed you in the first set. This is the size difference. This was a set of 6. And you got a 7.5. This is a 5. So, that's the size difference in the sets. And this is a 79 it looks to be like a red glitter. Guys, we got to get through these kind of quick. Oh, oh my gosh. Look how pretty that is. Look how pretty that is. These do have, I don't know, the smell. I don't know. It's not a bad smell, but there's definitely like an odor. It's not terrible. So there is... the first swatch and guys we will do two coats on all of these so you can see this is a 81 and it looks to be like a very dark burgundy and it looks like it may be more of a sheer tone oh it is it's no it's a, like a dark plum it does seem to be kind of sheer
Okay. And let's go with a 80, which looks to be like a cherry red. Oh, this one is so thick. Oh my gosh, that one is so thick. Is it supposed to be that thick? <laughs> Maybe it just seems to be that thick. But it is thick. Take a shot every time I say thick. Pretty color though. In the bottle, it looks like fake the fake blood for Halloween. But, so those are the first three swatches. We're going to keep going. I'm going to do these three darker colors here. So A82 looks to be like a black glitter. And I think I'll do it over here beside the red glitter. Yes, definitely a dark of gray blue gray it's definitely got some blue in it with a little bit of shimmer very pretty there's that one i know you guys probably cannot see the shimmer i will do some up close um photos and put on my instagram or on my facebook this is a deep, deep green. Can you guys see that? I'm going to go over here on this side. Oh my goodness gracious, this will be pretty for Christmas. Oh my goodness gracious, how pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. <laughs> Okay, and then let's do the, this looks like a deep teal. And it is. Can you guys see that? It is like a deep teal. These are so thick. Can you see how thick that looks? I'm going to go this way. All right. I'm going to run out of room over here on this side. Let me put this little nail wheel up here. Then I think I want to go to the greens since we're kind of heading in that direction. This is A74. I'll pick this up so you guys can see those blues and greens there. This is a true olive. And again, this was called Fall Festivals. So these are fall toned colors so there's the greens and blues that we have right now trying to keep kind of keep them in order a73 which looks to be more like a Four screen. Oh, I think it has a little bit of shimmer in it. Yes, it has some gold. Some gold in that one. Oh, these are so pretty. The glitters, though, are amazing. This is more of a... Um, a lighter olive green. Springy green. I don't know what color you would call that. That's more of the um, khaki, like a khaki green. Okay. Put my lids back down on these. So I'm trying to keep them in order. So when I go back to do like a second coat. This one looks like it's going to be more of a limey green, A66. Oh, that's got a 
that's like full coverage on first coat. Pretty. Okay, so there's the greens. Now we're going to go into, there's only like a yellow glitter and then it starts going into the pumpkin-y colors, of course, since it's fall. Um, and there's like several pumpkin-y colors. I'm going to do the glitter first. Oh, oh my gosh, how pretty. Oh my gosh, how pretty. Okay. That is gorgeous. Oh, that's pretty. Okay. Wish my light was working so you guys could see it better. Um, this one is A75 and it is getting into a yellow tone. This one's a little bit more of like a mustardy. Yes, definitely kind of mustardy toned. And then A76. Kind of the same family, but deeper. A deeper shade. You're getting into those really deep mustards here. Okay. And then A69, we're getting into the pumpkin-y colors. Very pretty. Okay, and then A68. A little bit, it looks like a deeper. Oh no, it's more of a more bright pumpkin-y color here. We're getting down to the end of the wheel, so it's going to be hard for me to hold it. So, we're just kind of... I will pick it up and show you once it is fully cured and actually I'm going to do these two glitters here A77 and that'll leave me one fingertip to hold on to <gasps> that is so pretty is this the one I have on my hands I can't remember no I think it's the, the darker one I have on my hands Oh my gosh, how pretty. Look at that. This is the one I have on my ring finger, is this one. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. All right, I'm going to cure these for one minute. And while that is going, I'll grab this wheel that we were working on. We're going to do the blues. There's three blues. A65. I know I'm all up in your way there. I'm sorry. It's like a baby blue. Okay. I'm going to skip a finger and we're going to come over here on this side. So these will be good going into the holidays when you want those icy blue wintry looks. This will be perfect going into the holidays. So there is the blue. Okay. 
And then the next one is A64. Mmm, so pretty. Almost a Carolina blue. Almost, almost a Carolina blue. Probably get away with it. That one's almost full coverage on one application. Very nice. And then the last blue is a, a 63. And it is not quite a denim blue. But yeah, I'll be wearing these blues in the winter for sure. Okay, trying to keep them in order that I did them. So there are the three blues. Oops. This one needed a little bit more blue on it. Right down the side here. Make it nice and even, fully coated. So there's the three blues. Oh, that makes such a pretty like ombre. I'm going to grab this one. We're going to put that one in. So here are all the colors. Now I'm going to do a second coat on all these and then we'll come back, guys. Okay, guys, we are back. I have put two coats and the top coats. Now, most of these I did matte because I wanted to see how they looked matte. So, some of them I left with a shiny top coat and the rest I did with a matte, even the glitters. I wanted to see what the glitters would look like with the matte top coat. That is so cool. Look how shiny the gloss top coat is, guys. Get this kind of back where you guys can see. Oh my gosh. But the glitters to show you like the difference in how the glitters look. Shiny top coat, matte top coat. Well, if I can get get it together there. so pretty okay so in here i have that first set that i did with the top coat on it and then there are the three blues one in the center of course is the glossy top coat and these two are matte top coats i don't use matte top coat um so that's why i was really curious to see what the matte colors would look like because i don't never really i don't use mattes but that is very cool um even the glitters look amazing with a matte over top all right guys i'm going to take you off of this stand Bloop. push you back up on this stand there we go lift this light up back where it goes and move it but that is if you kind of come around here the Beatles Fall Festival collection and there you can probably see better with this light up here oh my gosh guys how pretty I cannot wait to use more of these um, again that is this orange here this has the matte top coat on it And then here's the other collection that I did on the other video finished with the top coat. I left all those shiny. So you can see that top coat has a beautiful gloss to it. And then there's the blues. All right, guys, that is it. I will be doing more Beatles polish. Um, they're beautiful and so far let's see i did my nails last night we'll see how they last at work 
um, where it does give my nails a beating. And I did just short my nails back again, so they're short again. Um, I cannot let them really get past my fingertips much or they'll lift. And they're just now starting to feel better. So um, that is all of the beetle polish so far. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Be sure you get in on that giveaway I have going. I'll leave it li listed, linked down below in the description box. And I'll also have the, um, the link to the Fall Festival collection if you want this collection. And um, I'll also see if I can find a light, like a, um, sometimes they do a collection with a light, the Beatles do, so um, I'll leave you a bunch of links in the description box. I will see you guys on the next one.